what's up tribe <laughs> welcome back to my youtube channel i'm sorry for disappearing from you guys for so long so what has brought me here today is to just update you that i'm going to uninstall my artificial dreadlocks yeah i just think it's time i've procrastinated about this for a very long time i was to take them out um at nine months old but due to the procrastination and being busy and all that has made me stay with them for this long and uh guys right now uh they are they are um one year old i got my my dreadlocks installed uh, in um 2022 11th october and right now as i'm shooting this video uh, we are on date 24 the 24 october so it has surpassed a year with some days yes and i just hope that uh, they have not locked because i've heard stories about dreadlocks that if you stay with them for long they might get that may they they might end up being locked and then you'll have to stay like with the um, permanent dreadlocks for the rest of your life so yeah i i texted the guy that installed them uh for me since i got them where i used to stay initially and i had to move and because of distance and fair and all that i haven't been able to go there for retouch i've been changing locations like clothes <laughs> and i don't know if they've been doing a good job to my hair because when i texted him that i want to uninstall my dreadlocks he asked me some challenging questions and i just hope that those guys did, did not mess up with my hair yeah so this is how they look right now this is how they look right now and i just feel like it's time to to remove them yeah so guys i have like high expectations with these dreadlocks you see the way they say that uh if you had dreadlocks for long your hair grows it increases in volume and in length that's the expectation that i have right now with my hair uh, let me sit down so guys i have like a lot of expectations when i installed my my dreadlocks my 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 hair was so light and then it was not that long so i just expect that they have grown right now and that has it katika and they've grown long yes i just expect that so that is what i'm going to do tomorrow so today 24th october marks my last day with the dreadlocks yes but i'm so emotional but um, i might end up taking them back maybe next year maybe june because i heard that when you uh uninstall them correctly you can uh, reinstall them again so guys i have high expectations that my hair has really grown <laughs> i don't know if i should reduce my expectations to zero but i just hope that my hair has grown i just hope i just hope my hair has grown guys so i'll see you tomorrow uh at the salon i'll tag his um his page he's on tiktok he's on youtube he's on ig so that if you're interested in getting dreadlocks you can uh, hit him up so that he can install them for you i've saved a lot dreadlocks is a uh, really money saving i've saved a lot from going to salon and that uh it was just tedious for me and then last year i was busy with field work so i never really had enough time to even go to the salon i would stay shaggy uh, in several uh, occasions 
So, uh, my loctician is the one who recommended dreadlocks for me and sincerely it has been a, a great journey it's a, it has been a great and easy journey yeah so see you tomorrow there and i'll also show you the results <laughs> hope they'll be positive yeah bye hey guys so i'm heading out as i told you now I'm going to undo my dreadlocks, see you there, and I'm going to show you the results. My outfit of the... This is the outfit of the day. A black dress. Okay, it's hot, guys. I don't know if, if I'll survive in this sun with this black dress, but hope I will. Bye-bye, see you there. After... 2000 years later those were my dreadlocks on the floor scattered on the floor and as you can see i've lost a significant amount of hair yes but we move